Have you ever thought about storing your Oracle Analytics snapshots in Oracle Cloud? Now you can by selecting the Oracle Cloud Storage option when you export your snapshot. The export feature gives you the option to back up and manage your snapshots on your local file system or to a storage bucket on Oracle Cloud infrastructure. So why keep snapshots in Oracle Cloud Storage? Oracle recommends cloud storage if you regularly manage large snapshots or experience issues exporting large snapshots to your local directory. It's also the easiest way to migrate content between your development, test, and production environments. Before you select the Oracle Cloud Storage option, you or your administrator must set up the storage bucket where you want to keep your snapshots. You'll be asked to enter location details for the storage bucket when you click Storage Details. In the Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Console, Check that you or another user have the security policies required to create and connect to the Oracle Cloud Storage Bucket. Next, verify that you've generated an API key pair for the user and downloaded the private key file to your local drive. Be sure to write down the configuration file preview snippet information, as you'll need it later when you export the snapshot. Confirm the Oracle Cloud Storage Bucket setup. It looks good so far. In the OCI console, we created a storage bucket for our snapshot in object storage, identified a user with access to the storage bucket, and obtained connection detail for the bucket. In your Analytics Cloud environment, select the snapshot you want to export to cloud storage. In Storage Container Details, enter the name of the bucket you want to use, the OCI region, and tenancy ID where you created the bucket the ID of the user with access to the bucket, and this user's key fingerprint details. You can find all this information in the configuration file preview snippet that you copied down earlier when you generated the API key. Select the private key file that you downloaded to your local drive, and click Next. In the file name field, enter Snapshot May 4. You can save your snapshot in an existing folder, or create a new folder for it. Let's save this snapshot in a new folder called May Backups. In the File Name field, add May Backups before the snapshot file name. Make sure you include a forward slash at the end of the folder name. If you want to switch back to the default file name and root folder location, click Refresh Data. For now, keep the folder and file name you entered and click OK. Enter and confirm the snapshot password. You'll need this password in the future when you import the snapshot. Click Export. The snapshot export was a success. Click OK. You can find your snapshot in your Oracle Cloud Storage bucket at any time. If you need to import the snapshot, either to restore or migrate the content saved in the snapshot, you simply enter the same Oracle Cloud Storage details that you used to export the snapshot. Let's import the snapshot we exported previously. Locate the snapshot in the folder you saved it in or type the folder path in the name of the snapshot file to locate it instantly, and click OK. Enter the password for the snapshot, and click Import. Great! You successfully imported your snapshot from cloud storage. Now you can use this snapshot to restore your system to the state when the snapshot was taken. In this video, I showed you how to take a snapshot of Oracle Analytics Cloud and store it in a storage bucket on Oracle Cloud Infrastructure. Then I showed you how to import the snapshot from cloud storage in case you need it to restore your system. Check us out at docs.oracle.com.